ice, could only get it to the blue, it's kept in by Jetty. Fed right half wall, then a centering pass deflected on Charleston, and he makes Charleston. it to the far side wall, and the Crusaders fire it off the far glass to the red line, and Lucas runs his man over in open ice. He's going to get called for a penalty here as it's poked. They're going to call it roughing. to the mid-blue line for Bentz. That left circle to Hart. Spinning back, Hannah Rizama sticking wide right of the net. The other way. Right wing carry in by Laskowski. Fed to the slot and Scott shoots. And a great right pass save made by Pierce Charles. Getting pucks through on Carter Guylander when they've been a man up. Off the draw, Jetty got pushed softly into the end wall. And the ref's going to call another penalty. And it's a hook. May over the Sherwood Park line. Chipped it ahead of Plessy. Out of his reach. Oh. He, the ref calls Plessy for slashing and is going to give Sherwood Park a four on three. Bounces free to Lucas, who's got lots of space here. Starts up the left wing side and then banks it all the way down. And that's huge because the Crusaders just got a five on three and now it expires. Corner. Puck pops free to the high slot. Wiseblatt's got it there. Zigzags around a defender and shoots it right on. Rebound, Mashey backhands it. Just wide left of the net. Nifty little delay move by Wiseblatt to set up that chance. And now he's got it at the left point. Skates mid blue line, leaves it for Campbell. Shooting through a screen. He scores! The shot came from Tyler Campbell in the high slot. Jordan DeSico is positioned in front of the net. May have tipped that one in. And either way, the Bandits have opened the scoring in this one. one. Left wing, it's Savoy carrying in. Fed across Zapernick. Fires, save made. Oh, by Boyko. He collects in the left corner. Centers it. Wide open, Wiseblatt. He shoots. Save made. Rebound, Wiseblatt. Can't get a shot away. Zone anyway. At the end, Walker's hitters take it away. Cut it in front. And the backhander is robbed by Charleston. It was Laskowski who drove to the top of the crease after taking the turnover. Had a wide open net and could not beat Charleston. Then a high slot shot by Sean White. They average more than four goals per game, 4.08. I know they're second to Brooks. They're second by a mile as the Bandits are averaging 5.36 goals for per game. Garrett in right wing by Tice, dropping one back to Plessy. Had it poke free, recollects right circle and shoots. He scores! Nathan Plessy again. Three games back from injury. Three points for the captain as he risks that one home from the right faceoff dot. Lost control initially, but then recollected, cut in closer, and swings that one home to double Take on the Mustangs. Left point shot by Jetty through his screen. That one is saved by Charleston, and he gets slashed twice. And the ref called. And to Cody Laskowski. He skates up the near wall, turning and shooting, blocked by Ethan Lund. And it's spun to center by Boyko for Gravel to cut right wing and over the Crusader line. Dangles around a defender to the right circle. He shoots. He scores! A filthy dangle by Simon Gravel around a Sherwood Park defender. And from the right circle, he snipes home the man. It's third of the night to make it 3 nothing, Brooks. For him to score from there, he still managed to do it. Here come the Crusaders now, though. McCarr blows up his man in the slot. Tanner Finkerrick got set flat on his back, and then Harrison gets knocked down by Finkerrick, nowhere near the puck, and the refs will actually call interference on the Crusaders there. He put it left corner, Gravel back to LeMay, left tap wall. He puts it left point to Seco. Seco knifes it left tap wall to LeMay, skating to the circle, put it side of the net. Gravel fed it in front, chopped that, scores! And it's convert on the power play, and it's Gravel again from the shot of the net. A bit different as they've held Sherwood Park off the score sheet, but now a wide open chance in front. Franzak shoots it wide left of the net, and Brooks will be called for hooking. Here comes the crew up the middle. Franzak is out to the red line. Right wing, he's over the bandit. Blue fans on a shot, but it's picked up by Scott. Right circle, fed in front, and it deflects in past Charleston and the Crusaders after being gifted power play chance after power play chance. Yeah, seventh Five. power play of the game. I was wrong there. I've been losing track, as I might be forgiven for doing. So it's a 4-1 game, and it's Franzak who gets credit for the goal, it came off the rush. But now the Bandits take one away in the O-zone. Campbell, a breakaway, he shoots, he scores! That is a hell of a response by Tyler Campbell just seconds after Sherwood Park gets on the board. Campbell takes one away in the offensive zone, streaks in uncontested 
and fires home a breakaway Rooster to make it 5-1 Bandits here in Sherwood Park. Picked up that left wing and McCarr carries into the left circle. Centering pass, Harrison wide open in front. His point blank shot is denied. Brooks. He got it off a stick of Tyson out to the rim. Then left wing side and Plessy barrels into the left circle. Hooked the whole way and only pokes it in behind the net and gets hauled down to the ice. And... I think it's a penalty shot this time. Right. In on Guy Lander, right side. Into the hash marks. He shoots off the left post. Boy, the other way. Crew leading score on a three on one. Fed to the slot. Wide open chance for Zappernick. But his backhander is blocked by a sliding Vachon. Then a high slot shot is saved by Charleston. Knocked down by Wallace at the end wall. Centering pass. Wee Shor uh, Shorster all alone in front. Backhander denied by Charleston. And he's on top of that loose puck. And they're going to call a penalty shot for Sherwood Park because I think Weisblatt covered it up in his own blue paint. Charleson takes the puck at center ice. Carries in left wing side. Down to the hash marks. He shoots. Blocker save! Pierce Charleston and the Bandits remain up 5-1. to one. Stick back to the end wall. Gravel recollects behind the net. Drops off to Lee, whose one-timer was blocked. But it's turned over down low. And Gravel centers to LeMay. He shoots. He scores! The route is officially on, and Simon Gravel's got a three-point night in the third period. He finds William LeMay from the left side of the net. Two goals in the second for Brooks. The Bandits pull away with four here. Now they turn it over in their own end, and a right circle shot by Tanner Finkerak. He scores the most insignificant goal. Breakaway, it was the penalty shot, of course, by Brandon Wallace there. He's forced to face another one there off the turnover. Because now here's Armstrong barreling in left wing of the circle. He shoots and he rang the post, but it looked off. And Plessy takes this away for Brooks. Takes a couple of cross checks and time runs out. The Bandits win their 10th consecutive. They obliterate the Sherwood Park Crusaders on the road tonight by a 6-2 final score. And they move to a nationwide best 24-2 on the season.